Welcome to Sage Audio. Today, let's look at the top 88 free mixing plugins. But first, if you have a mix that you need to have mastered, send it to us to receive a free mastered sample of it with the link in the description. Kilohertz Essential Bundle. Let's start off with this amazing free bundle by Kilohertz. It includes 30 free plugins, including everything you might need from EQ to delay, distortion, and even some unique processing like formant shifters, reversers, and a transgate. Additionally, when loaded into a DAW, they have a super small footprint. Let's take a listen to the EQ, distortion, and flanging plugins being used on a mix. DTM Hacker Bundle DTM Hacker is offering their plugins for free on Gumroad, including their Chorus, Flanger, Phaser, Transient Shifter, and Vibrato plugins, all of which have a great interface and are easy to use. I like the Transient Shaper in particular, which lets you affect the attack and the release's gain and timing. Let's take a listen to the Flanger and the Phaser, and definitely check out some of their other free or optionally paid for plugins. If you're enjoying the video, hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. It's free and it helps us bring you more videos. Pitch Drift and more by Baby Audio. Baby Audio just released this new Pitch Drift plugin. At lower time and depth settings, it has a really pleasant effect, similar to tape wobble or modulation, but you could also increase both to create really interesting and creative processing. Baby Audio also offers three other free plugins. A free delay with included Ducker, stereo image modulator that's from their VHS plugin, and a delay reverb combo that could be randomized. Let's take a listen to this new Pitch Drift plugin. Blend EQ by Analog Obsession. Blend EQ is interesting. It's basically two six filter EQs housed within one plugin. Now these two EQs could also be blended, resulting in really unique curves. By clicking the Analog Obsession text, we could turn on over sampling, and by clicking the Blend EQ text, we could affect all bands blend values at once. Lastly, we can cause overdrive distortion by increasing the input and reducing the output. Let's take a listen. Rare SE by Analog Obsession. Rare SE has been one of my favorite pull tech emulations for a while now, and the developer just recoded the entire plugin, so this gives me an excuse to cover it again. In short, we get two pull tech EQs, one for the left and one for the right channel. Now what's great about this processor is that it could be switched to mid and side, giving us the ability to affect our stereo image, which is something that I haven't really seen in any other pull tech emulation. Let's take a listen to the plugin. D Reverb by Stone Voices. D Reverb is definitely the best sounding free reverb plugin that I've ever come across, and it also has an insanely long RT60 option of 100 seconds, something I've never seen in another plugin. It offers wet dry, pre delay and diffusion, parallel input filtering, frequency crossovers and basic EQ, and stereo width. Lastly, there's an excursion section, but I couldn't find a manual, nor do I really understand what this does. So if you do know, please let me know in the comments. Let's take a listen and test out the 100 second decay time. Dirty LA by Bedroom Producers Block. Bedroom Producers Blog has made it a habit of combining saturation with other popular forms of processing, and I think this LA-2A compressor-saturator combo is their best yet. 
At lower settings, we can achieve a few dB of attenuation with some program-dependent timing, as well as some mild distortion. That said, I think this plugin is best suited for heavy compression and distortion, but used in parallel with the mix dial. Let's take a listen. If you're enjoying the channel, use the search box to watch more of our videos. T-Puncher by Techovation. Although this free version is a bit limited in its functionality, the subtle sound of this transient shaper is great. You could increase the middle dial to increase the impact of transients, or reduce it to cause some compression. For an aggressive sound, try increasing the input into the processor. Let's take a listen to it on some drums. EQ 302 by Red Rock Sound. Although most engineers use fully parametric EQs by now, having 32 bands to finely control the response isn't too common. Now, I personally like how minute the amplitude changes are, that we could choose between 6 and 12 dB slopes, and the optional linear phase processing and or oversampling. Lastly, it comes with more than 60 presets and even works as a standalone application outside of a DAW. Let's take a listen to it on a mix. BYOD by Chow DSP. Last up, we have a great plugin that I've covered before, but I definitely think it deserves some more attention. BYOD includes 43 free plugins, all available within a routing matrix. It's designed for guitar effects, but honestly, some of the plugins work great for other applications. Let's take a listen to it using some processors that are geared toward mixes instead of guitars. If you have a mix that you need to have mastered, send it to us to receive a free mastered sample of it with the link in the description. Thank you so much for watching. 